sensational development in the sandalwood drug ring. The ED has now filed a money laundering probe into the case. And this comes even as a political patronage is under the CCB lens after a whistleblower named Prashant Sambaragi named Congress MLA Zamir Ahmed saying that he was linked to arrested accused actor Sanjana and had attended a drug party in a casino with him in Sri Lanka. The Congress MLA, however, has denied all allegations and filed a complaint against Prashant, the whistleblower. Let's go across to Deepak, who's joining us live on the broadcast. Now, Deepak, uh, Congress MLA Zamir Ahmad has filed a complaint. He's taking legal action. But as far as uh, this entire drug nexus is concerned, now a money laundering angle is what the ED is looking at. Yes, it's going to be very interesting here because, you know, uh, sources tell us that there are a lot of documents that uh, have, have have come under the possession of the crime branch officials while investigating this drug case, uh, which definitely needs, uh, you know, a larger lens. And probably the ED, uh, uh, you know, can do justice in this particular matter by looking into some of the property uh, documents, some of the, you know, uh, transactions that were uh, made between a, a few accused in this particular case, especially during the time of the lockdown, has raised several questions as to where this money came from, where was it actually going? And also, uh, whether they were being channeled into other, uh, you know, illegal routes, other uh, than the, the drug issue itself, uh, that's in question. So it's going to be very interesting now with the ED that's going to be looking into this matter, how many more skeletons tumble out.